Welcome back to Thales Protocol. Today, I'm going to give you a quick guide on how to stake Thales tokens and receive rewards. Uh, to do this, you want to be connected to the Thales website on Layer 2 Optimism with a wallet that has some ETH for transactions and some Thales tokens to stake. And I'll show you how to purchase some Thales tokens if you don't already have them in just a second. So what is staking? Staking is a way to generate passive income by depositing a cryptocurrency, such as Thales, into a protocol, and then that protocol provides you with rewards uh, at the end of the staking period. With Thales, it's once every week. Besides gaining these rewards, staking Thales tokens also gives you voting power in upcoming council elections, which happen every six months. Uh, you can check out our governance video for more details on how to do that. And then staking dailies also qualifies you for gamified staking bonus rewards. I'm going to make a much longer video on staking, explaining all the concepts in detail and all the processes and steps. So check back for that if you want more details, uh, as well as the specifics on how to generate maximum gamified staking bonuses. But for here, I'm going to try to just make this a pretty quick video to get you all started and staked. So to get started, uh, move over to the left menu here and click on the Thales token page. So this has a link at top to the Optimism contract for the Thales token. And then this lists the current price on Optimism, but it's also a link to the Uniswap pair. So if you don't already have any Thales tokens, you can visit this link and purchase some to stake. Next to that's market cap, the total circulating supply, total supply, and this is a link to the seller bridge, which allows you to bridge Thales tokens from L1 over to L2, where you can stake. Then below this is three tabs, staking, vesting, and LP staking. With staking, it'll show you the current stake balance. I don't have any yet, but I'll go through the process in a second. And then the number of uh, rewards that are still in escrow, which I'll also explain shortly. And then here is the reward percentage. So again, you just deposit your Thales tokens, return each week, and claim a certain amount of those rewards. And at the rate currently, that equals 36.84% APR in rewards. And next to it's APY, which at the moment is 44.35%. And then the green number here is the gamified staking bonus. So if you meet all the criteria for maximum gamified rewards, you'll receive an additional 18.42% APR, which for APY comes to 28.92%. So this will show you uh, your share of the total staked daily tokens and then what to expect for rewards for this period. So this is where you will see the rewards and you can actually claim. And this shows you the gamified staking portion. So again, go to that longer video for details, but essentially you stake synthetic tokens, receive some Thales tokens as part of gamified staking. And then here, just use the protocol, use the products, trade with the AMM, and you will receive some bonus for the volume that you generate here. Okay, so let's actually just go ahead and do it. Uh, like I said, I have here, you'll see, 10 Thales tokens that I can deposit. So where is the amount stake here? To do that, you can see I have my max at 10.75. Uh, let's just do five for now so I can do more videos later. First step is to approve the transaction. So the moment I'll have approval for Thales tokens. And then you'll want to complete the MetaMask or whatever Web3 wallet you're currently using to allow the protocol to move your tokens. All right, looks like that went through. So now I just need to stake my five Thales, and here's even a network estimation for the fees, which is nice. So I will confirm the transaction to stake my five Thales tokens into the protocol, and there we go. So now, Let's refresh the page to see if the stats have updated yet. So five total, and I can expect to claim this amount when I return at the end of the staking period on Wednesday. So the staking period ends each Wednesday at 12 p.m. UTC. After that, you can return, come down here, and claim the Thales that you currently have available to receive. Um, now, once you do that, any tokens that you claim as reward go into vesting. So that will show here on their escrowed balance. Escrow, if you know, basically just means it's an account that another party is controlling for a short period of time. 
So when you claim your rewards, you don't actually have access to them right away. They sit in the protocol for 10 weeks. And you can see that by clicking on the vesting tab. So if I was to claim some rewards, I will have a row here listing the amount I claimed and a eight, 10 weeks in the future, which will show when I can return. And by clicking vest here, I can actually take those rewards into my wallet. So again, you stake, you return at the end of the period to claim those rewards, which you go into vesting. It will show them here. and will show a date 10 weeks in the future. When you return on that date, the amount from that claim will show up here as available to vest, which means you can then take them and actually claim them into your wallet. And then best practice generally is to return and restake them so that you can continue to compound your staking rewards. So that's the uh, standard staking process. So go to the Thales token page, let the protocol approve the movement of your Thales tokens, and then stake them. Then come back at the end of the period, anytime after 12 p.m. UTC on Wednesday, to claim the rewards you've earned for that period, which go into vesting. You can then return 10 weeks after that to vest those token rewards into your wallet. Now, finally, there's one more way to earn rewards, and that's LP staking. Again, I'll go into this in more detail in a longer video. But generally, the idea is to provide Thales token liquidity by depositing Thales tokens paired with wrapped Ethereum into Gelato's GUNI pool. When you do that, you will receive LP tokens back from that Gelato GUNI pool, basically as a receipt for the Thales and wrapped ETH that you've deposited in their pool. That allows other traders to trade dailies, um, and you receive rewards for LP. You can also take those LP tokens that the GUNI pool gave you as a receipt of the tokens you've deposited there, and you can stake them here. So similar uh, UI, just approve and then stake the LP tokens, the LP token that you received through the Gelato GUNI pool, and then you can return each week, and you can claim rewards for that LP staking. And there is no vesting on LP rewards. So those automatically go to your wallet. So now that you know the process, go and get some Thales tokens or bridge them over to L2 if you've gained them from the airdrop. Uh, jump in and stake them. And then just make sure you return each week to claim those rewards. And uh, think about staking synthetic tokens as well as using the product uh, on Thales as much as possible. That's only going to give you bonus rewards that you can receive each week. All right. Happy staking. Thank you.